John Hot Rod Williams, former Cavaliers center forward, passing away today at the age of 53. And Sam, I know that Hot Rod, to you, was one of the key players in, in those teams of the late 80s, early 90s. And, and maybe, I, I don't want to say unsung hero, but certainly a guy who didn't get the credit that he deserved for the role he played in those teams. You talk about Mark Price and Brad Doherty and Larry Nance and you know Ron Harper before he got traded and Steve Kerr now the Warriors coach you know a lot of guys on that team he's a lot he's a guy who was not forgotten so much but not mentioned as much as the other guys but did play obviously a huge role he really became one of the few guys and one of the first guys and Campy and I were talking about this earlier a guy who had size at six foot eleven could run the floor uh, like a guard almost yep and shoot from 18 feet out. He could defend all the positions on the floor. Uh, just brought everything basketball-wise. And, and as we know, uh, Jeff, you and I had been covering the team for some time. Um, one of the great, great guys. Yeah, just a, a very guy. gracious man. Well, Jeff, does, you know, when you look back at Hot Rod, to me, I think he was the kind of guy who helped really solidify that basketball team. I think he helped bring the toughness to that basketball team. You look at what he brought every single night. I think he really reshaped and redefined the power forward position along with Kevin McHale, Kevin Willis, and those kind of guys because they all had that great size, but they all had great mobility. And then scouts and other personnel people start looking for those type of players. So I think when you look at Hot Rod, he really shaped, reshaped this uh, whole league. He was part of those key teams, Sam, that, that were such a great great time in Cavalier yes. history with with Craig Elo and Mark Price, Brad Doherty, Larry Nance, and teams that came oh so close but really played the game the right way under Lenny Wilkins. That was one of the things that I'll always remember about them is how they played the game. And Lenny had them playing the game. You know, we always say the right way, but that's truly how it was. I mean, they played basketball almost like you would read about it in an encyclopedia. <laughs> you know, they, they moved the ball. There was never any shortage of outside shooters. They always passed up an open shot for a great shot. And, and Hot Rod, obviously, a huge part of that. Uh, defensively, you know, we didn't really talk about him much defensively. But uh, as you said, Campy, he mm -hmm. really could defend, you know, four of the five positions mm -hmm. and do it well. He really, six foot eleven, was really one of the first six foot eleven small forwards a lot of time coming off the bench. I love the way they spread the floor. I love the way that team moved the basketball. Mm -hmm. And it was a pleasure to watch all of them combined. And John Hot Rod Williams, of course, a huge part of the success of the Cavaliers in the mid to late 80s and early 1990s. Passing away today at the age of 53.